Hey guys, uh, in this tutorial we're going to go over navigation and keyboard shortcuts which are super useful to supercharge your productivity when you're using Roam Research. So in terms of navigation, uh, there's really only a few places to go. So one is your daily notes which they update uh, daily. So if I go here you'll see that it'll go to June 8th and then the graph overview which will show you all of the notes that you have and the, uh, the way they're linked and the clusters as well. Uh, all pages which will show you all of your pages and the uh, really useful thing with this one is that it will show you the word count, how often it's been linked to, that's the mentions here, uh, when it was updated and when they were created and you can also sort them uh, by each of these uh, categories. So now on to uh, our keyboard shortcuts. So to bold a word or a sentence, uh, it's just Command B. To highlight is Command H. To zoom in and out is by doing Command period or Command uh, comma. So to zoom in is Command period. To zoom out is Command comma. Now uh, let's move on to the next one. Collapse expand. That's just Command up and Command down. Uh, selecting blocks, that's shift and up and shift down. So we can do this and then we can also select this entire thing like so. Um, moving the cursor, oh, select by parts, that's uh, alt, shift and left and alt, shift and right. And then moving the cursor to the start and the end is just control A and control E. Uh, headings, it's just uh, Command Alt 1, Command Alt 2, and Command Alt 3. So they're super useful to have. Um, to link something, it's just Command K. So do it like this, and then you can write Google, google.com. Um, to do, uh, done. So this is just Command and Enter. So you'll see that it shifts between the two. So I'll do it like this, and then do it again. It's like this. Uh, right sidebar, so uh, you just shift click on something that's linked and then it will load up here uh, and I can shift click on this one here and then it will load another round of things here on the sidebar. Toggle bracket displace, uh, this one is a little bit buggy sometimes, it doesn't always work but it's control C and you'll see that, I'm pressing it now, there we go, and you'll see that it shows the brackets here and if I press it again it will eventually not show the brackets. There we go. And finally, we have to toggle bullet points. So on any of the selections, you can right click and this will give you the options of what you can do here. So you've also got a lot of the similar options, but I prefer to use uh, keyboard shortcuts since it's usually faster to do it that way. Now to find more options, there's this help bar where you can see all the other shortcuts that you can play around with and you can also do forward slash and this will give you a lot more options to uh, check out and just to see uh, what else is available. Uh, so I encourage you to sort of look through these. This does get updated so this does change periodically uh, which is nice and uh, yes and I hope you enjoy this tutorial.